Hey guys, Adrian Morrison here, and in this video, uh, I'm gonna talk about how to target your custom audiences, uh, better known as retargeting audiences, in Facebook. It's really simple. This is gonna be a super short video, so I just want you to see how it's done, where you select the audience, and um, how you can benefit from it. So let's jump into Facebook right now. All right, so here we are in my Facebook account. And once again, I've already gone ahead and hit create an ad and uh, just gone through the, the nonsense stuff. And we're at the point where we choose our age group, gender, keywords, our daily budget, all that good stuff. Um, <clears throat> you'll notice up here at the top, there is a little uh, spot that says custom audiences. I mean, this is just so simple. Um, what you do is you just click on it and it brings up all of your custom audiences. There are only two in this little sample account that I'm filming in, but all of them will come up and all you have to do is say, you know what, I wanna target everybody that visited my grandma moon and back necklace uh, that I sold a while ago, boom. All right, so now everybody that clicked on this product previously that's in this custom audience um, is now in my target audience for a new product that I'm marketing. Or I could be remarketing to them the same product, right? And saying, hey, you didn't buy it before, you just visited. So here's your second opportunity to make the purchase. That's known as retargeting or remarketing. So if you would like to do multiples, you can. So if you have a bunch of different grandma items that you've uh, promoted in the past, and you have a custom audience for each one of them, they'll all be here. So you can go in and you can just put as many of these in as you'd like and target that entire group of audiences. If you have a whole bunch of people in here, um, if you have a whole bunch of people in here, then uh, you could just type, type in whatever you're looking for, right? And it'll pull up any audience with uh, that keyword in it. So for me in my main account, I have hundreds of audiences, of custom audiences. So to scroll through is a pain in the butt. So if I'm looking for my custom audiences for the Second Amendment niche, the gun niche, the sports niche, the grandma niche, I'll usually just come here and type it in and it'll pull it up. And it'll do the same thing for lookalike audiences as well, but I'll still film another video on that. All right, now another thing is you can exclude custom audiences. So you could say, hey, um, I wanna target everybody that is in this particular custom audience here, but I want to take everybody that's in this audience and exclude it, saying in other words, do not show anybody that's in this audience here that may also be in this audience, exclude them. Like this could be your buyers. Just forget what, the, what this audience says. This is just a sample. But let's say you had a custom audience of all of your buyers and you wanted to exclude them. You only wanted to hit the visitors, the people that did not, that they visited but they didn't purchase. Um, this is one way you can do that. But if I'm being honest, I don't do that very often. I just wanted to show you that feature is there. Okay, so now we've got everybody in this custom audience uh, being bullseye targeted. You can still manage the age group and the gender. Um, I usually do not do that because, I mean, these are already like the best of the best of the best because they're people that have clicked on my ad before for this product. So um, I usually don't fool with anything else. I just come down here and I will put in my daily budget and my bid for my traffic, name my ad set, and then click next and go in and, and actually put in my image and my ad copy and finish creating the ad. So targeting your custom audiences is super simple. Once you get into where you're creating your ad, you just come to where it says custom audiences, click, choose which audiences you want to target or which audiences you want to exclude, and Facebook will instantly do it for you. That's it. Very simple, very short and sweet video, but now you know where to go if you wanna start adding custom audiences in 
to your targeting. All right, that's it. I'll see you on the next video.